I read a lot online in response to the CTMU. Well, the CTMU is one big tautology, so-called super tautology. That means it says nothing. That means it adds nothing. Tautologies are redundant. Okay, that's the semantic version of a tautology, right? A rose is a flower, a horse is an animal, et cetera, et cetera. The most general tautology, by the way, the most general redundancy is that a piece of reality is reality, okay? Is composed of reality. A part of reality is composed of the whole we call reality. In mathematics, we call this idempotence or idempotence, right? Where you multiply something by the identity element and you, you get the identity element itself. And so when it comes to reality theory, which the CTMU terms mathematical metaphysics, we find that a tautology is the only way to capture a self-containment property or self-composition property. The whole criticism of reality being one big tautology is that it's circular. Circular logic, that's a, that's a fallacy. Actually, if we look back to many philosophers who identified the vicious circle in defining reality, they all said that you can either de defy the circle and therefore have no definition of reality and had no overall intelligibility of any theory or observation you make, or you can somehow divine the right way of entering and structuring the circle. Okay, because remember, the circle is not a geometrical object in this case. The circle is basically the fact that you need to presuppose your conclusion when you're defining reality.